Hey there everyone, in this tutorial I have come up with a really good Swarajadi indeed. Uh, this Swarajadi is in the Raga Ananda Bhairavi. The title of this Swarajadi is Rave Mo Ke. So first let's discuss some points about Ananda Bhairavi Raga. This Ananda Bhairavi is uh, the derivative of 20, 20th. 20th Melartha Raga, which is Nada Bhairavi. Nada Bhairavi, Ananda Bhairavi. Okay. 20th Melartha Raga, Nada Bhairavi. Ananda Bhairavi is the derivative of 20th Melartha Raga. Then, when we check its Arohana and Arohana, we can find out this is a. Uh, no, the, its uh, Arohana is not in the, the. not in proper order. The normal order will be Sari Gama Padani. But here it is Sage Ri Gama Pada Pasa. So, we can find out it's in a jumbled order, right? So, we say this uh, raga is Arohana as Vakra. But it's Avarohana is Sani Dapa Magarizala, like we um, discussed in the previous lesson. All the seven notes are there. So, we can call this raga as a, uh, it's Avarohana as Samburna. So, when we say it's Arohana and Avrohana, this Raga is a Vakra Samburna Raga, okay? Then, there are a lot of many foreign notes in this Raga, so we call this Raga as a Bhashanga Raga, Bhashanga Raga, and um, there are three foreign notes, three. Before we go to that um, foreign notes, let's discuss the um, Swarasthanams first. When we say the Swarasanams of this Raga, we can just simply say uh, the Swarasanams of Nala Bhairavi as well, okay? Because both are same. Sa is Shadjam, Ri is Chadr Shudhi Rishabam, Ga is Sadharna Gandharam, Ma is Shuddha Madhyamam, Pa is Panjavam, Da is Shuddha Daivadam, and Ni is Kaishi Nishadam. These are the notes of Nala Bhairavi and, uh, and the Bhairavi also. But as this Ananda Bhairavi versus some foreign notes, I mean, uh, like, like I mentioned earlier, there are three foreign notes in this Ananda Bhairavi Raga. And so, when we say about this Anya Swaram, these foreign notes, we should say which are they. And they are one is Gantharam, the second is Daivadam, and the third is Nishada. What we have here is Sadhana Gantharam. So, the Anya Swaram will be Andhara Gantharam. The Daivadam we have here is Shuddha Daivadam. And so the um, foreign note will be Chadr Shudhi Daivala. Nishadam, what we have is Kaishi Nishadam. And so the Anya Swaram will be Kagali Nishadam. Okay. And for each foreign note usage, yes, there is certain usage for using each, uh, each foreign notes. For example, first the Andhara Gandhara. We just cannot submit uh, sing it like a Sadriga Sadriga. We just cannot sing it in such a way. For giving this usage, showing this Andhara Gantara, we have got a certain usage that is Pama Gagama. Okay. Pama Gagama. That's the usage for you uh, giving uh, Andhara Gantara. And for Chadashruti Daivadam. Actually, uh, even though we, if you are saying it as a da, we are saying ni pa ni pa. We are saying nishadam there. Okay, but that's the usage for chal uh, chal pa da pa or pa da pa. That's all fine. Then for kaagali nishadam, the usage is sa ni ni sa. That's the usage for kaagali nishadam. Yeah, let's. Sing the Arohana and Avarohana first. Sagari Gama Padhapasa. That's the Arohana. Here, Sagari Sa is plain, but Ga is been stepping down from Sa, then Maga, Ga. That's uh, Anisura for Ga, Gandhara. Sagari ri is plain, then Gama. Here, Ga ri ma ri that's the note for Gantara. Ga ma then pa dha pa that's actually pa ni pa kai ching shada. 
Pada pada sa. So when combine that as a phrase, it will sound like sa ga ri ga ma pada pa sa. Okay. Now the other one, it's sa ni da pa ma ga ri sa. Here it is sa. I lifted that shardja from Daivadam. Da sa. Sa ni ni has been stepping down from shardja. Sa ni. Sa ni da pa. Da and play is pa and is this play note. Sa ni da pa da ma ga ri. Ma is having a slide from shardja. Sa ma ma da ga ga is stepping down from madhyam. Ga ri sa ri is this play. Yeah. So when we sing it all together, it will sound like. First the R of Sa ga ri ga ma pa da pa sa Avra of Sa ni da pa ma ga ri sa That's it. Now, let's zoom into this lesson now. First, what do we mean? Pa ga pa ma ga ma Here they are. The first panjama is having three extra beats. So it should be sustained for that long. Pa one two three here. I'm starting with an answer. Pa that's Madhyam. Okay. Pa pa ma pa ma that's pa ma pa ma. Pa pa ma then ga ma ga ma that's Mari Mari ma ga ma then pa. Ma, that can be sung as a plain note, or ma pa ma like that also, no problem. Then pa pa ma ga ma pa ma then pa ma ga ri ga here pa ma pa is having an answer from Madhyam. Okay, it's having a slide from Madhyam. That's answer. Ma pa pa ma ga ri ga is having a slide from Madhyam. Pa ma ga ri and from this rishabam ga Even though we are saying it as Gandhara, we are actually singing it as ri ma ri ri ma ri ma ri ma like that. Pa ma ga ri ga Then ma ga ri from there ma Lift up that mandiva from this rishabam Ma ga ri sa. Those are the play notes. Ma ga. I sang a slide from Madhyam. Ma ga ri sa ni. Here we are actually saying as ni nishadam, but we are saying it as da. Sa da sa da sa da ni like that. Sa. That's also sa da sa. Then. Sa, this sa is been lifting up from daivada. Sa ni, like in the previous case, sa ni sa ni sa ni. Then ga ri from shardjam sa magari ga ri. Those much of notes are there. Answerums. Sa magari ga ri. Then. Then. Sagaringa, like in the Arogana. Sagaringa, ma pa da ma here, ma pa da ma pa pa da like that. Ma pa da then, ma pa ma pa ma pa ma like that. Ma pa ma and from this Madhyam Gari ma pa ga ma ri. Those are the Anusams. Ga ri ma pa ga ma ri then ga ma ga ri ma ri ma. So that much of detail is there in this Pallavi itself. So when we combine all those as a phrase, it will sound like the Pallavi will sound like pa pa ma ga ma pa ma pa ma ga ri ga.
like that. So, yeah, if you're okay with the Pallavi, let's uh, move on to the Anu Pallavi. Here, the first Panjama is not having three beats, extra beats. Uh, it is having just two. Like that, okay. Here, I am lifting up this Panjama from Madhyama like in the previous uh, Pallavi itself. Here it is. I'm actually using Andhra Gantara. Like that. Here, Pa and Sa. Panjama and Shadjam is just plain notes. That's uh, like we discussed about the ni in a, the Pallavi. Here, uh, the only change is that in the Pallavi we sang it in the uh, lower octave, and here it is in the higher octave. That's it. Then, sa sa da sa sa, and from this short jump, lift up that madhyam like sa ma. Okay, from short jump, just lift up madhyam. Sa ma, then ga re sa from madhyam. We should uh, press down this gandhara. Ma, the ga re sa ga. That's maga. Ga re sa re and sa is just plain notes. Ni sa pa here. That's sa da sa da. That's ni sa. That's da sa sa. Then pa. That's sa pa. That's pa. Then from that one jump, sa lift up short jump. Pa sa sa. Then the next short jump is sa. That's sa da sa. Sa sa ni da pa. Like in the avrogana, ni is having a slide from short jump. Da and pa is just plain note. Sa ni da pa dan. Pa ma ga ma pa ma ga ma. It is this pa ma pa ma ga ma ga. That's ma ga na ga ma ri. That's uh, sliding up to rishab, not for gada rishab. Then pa ma ga ma after. Pa pa one two pa ga ga ma oh, two beats are there for panjama pa ma ga ri ma pa ga ma ri ga ri then ga ma ga ri ga ma guys have an extra beat okay let's uh, discuss about this extra beat also because in some books I have seen some books uh, there are uh, there are some mistakes like. Uh, after this, sa ni da pa then pa ma ga ma ga here pa ma ga ma one ma is only having an extra beat pa ma ga ma pa ga pa is having two beat pa ma one ma for one pa ma ga ri ga ri ga a ri ga a ri Guys, is having one beat. Ga ri then ga ga ma. Guys, guys, having nothing. Yeah, let me combine all those phrases. Uh, then only you will get an idea. Pa pa ma pa sa sa ni then sa. Okay, the last Gantharam and Madhyam is having an extra bit. Ga ga ma ga, like that. Okay, then uh, let's now uh, move on to the 
Yeah, move on to the first sarna. First sarna. There are only uh, two sarnas in this lesson. In the previous lesson, there were five. When compared with the previous lesson, this is quite a uh, not a simple. Uh, I mean, a tiny one. That's it. So here it starts with the um, just like the uh, Pallavi and Anupallavi. Pa like that. Ma pa. Pa pa tha pa ma ga ma ma. That's the first phrase. Here, pa pa. The first pancham is being lifted up from Madhyam. Ma pa pa pa. And from this pancham, tha pa pa ni pa. Those are the notes. Pa tha pa tha ma ga ma ga ma ri. Pa. Then pa ma ga ri ma pa ma ga ma pa pa ma ga ri ga ga ri ma ri ri ma ri like that. Pa pa tha pa ma ga ma ma pa ma ga ri ga ga then ma ga ri zani here ma. Actually, we are now uh, standing on this rishabham. Ga ga ga. That's the and from this rishabham, lift up that ma like that. Ma ga ri zani. Ma ga ri ma ga. Guy is having a slide from Madhyam. Ma ga ri zani. That's sada 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 like that. Then. Sa ga ri sa ma ga ri sa ni. Sa ga ri. Up to that, we uh, learned it from Arohana. Sa ga ri sa ma ga ri sa ni. Here, sa ma ga ri sa ni. Almost all the notes are just play notes, except that for that in Gandhara. Sa ma ga. That's having a slight from Madhya. Sa ma ga ri sa ni ni. That's sa da sa da. Then the next phrase is sa ga ri sa pa ma ga ri here. Sa ga ri up to that it's R O N itself. Sa ga ri then sa pa ma ga ri here. Sa pa just plain words then ma ga ri ma is stepping down from panjamam. Ga is stepping down from madhyamam like that. Sa pa ma ga ri. Then ni sa ni da sa da ni sa ga ri guys ma ga like that ga ri ma ga ma ga ma ma ri ma ri like that ni sa ga ri ma ga pa ma pa ma is the plates. Then from that panja pa ma then pa pa tha pa pa ma ga ma here pa tha like we started this charana pa tha pa 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 ni pa that's the notes pa tha pa pa ma ga ma like here like in that a gender version of prayer we can give a hammering tone here pa tha pa pa ma ga ma. Ma ga ri ma and uh, Gandhara is having a slide from Madhyam up to Rishabham. Pa ga ga na up to Rishabham. Ma ri like that. Pa da pa pa ma ga ma ga ma. Why is um, really in a quick pace? Like that's a marima, ga marima, ga ma. So when you combine all those as a phrase, the first channel will sound like pa pa da pa ma ga ma ma pa ma ga ri ga ga ma ga ri zani sa ga ri sa ma ga ri zani. Sa ga ri sa pa ma ga ri ni sa ga ri ma ga pa ma 
After that, you should sing that Pallavi. <coughs> yeah, now let's move on to the second charma, the last charma. This charma also starts uh, almost like this, uh, the first one. That's the first phrase. But from Ma, I'm uh, lifting up Panjava. Ma pa, pa, da, da, pa, that's ni pa, that's ni. Pa, da, pa, ma, ga, ma is the. Actually, ma, uh, ga is having ma and ri, those are the notes. Ma, ri, ga. Okay. Pa, da, pa, ma, ga, then ma, ma. Here also, that's ma, ri, ma. Ma. Then you have to sustain for uh, about five beats. Okay, then. Ma, pa. Oh, here. Ma, we are lifting up madhyam from Sharjam. Sa, ma, ma. Then, pa, ma, gari. Here. Pa, ma, gari. Pa, pani, pani. Pa, ma, gari. Pa, ma, ma, gari. Those are the anisonyms. Pani pani pa ma ma ga ri pa ma ga ri pa tha pa ma ga ma 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 pa ma ga ri ma pa ma ga ri then ga ga then ah here it is ga ri ma ri ri ma ri ma ri ma like that then. Ma pa ma ga ri ma pa pa is having some anisonyms ma is plain ma pa ma ni pa ma pa ma ga ri that's pa ma ma ga ri ma ga ri ma pa ma ga ri then sa ni sa ma ga ri sa here I lifted up charge from Daivadam. Sa ni sa ma ga ri sa ma ni sa from Sharja I am lifting up Madhyama. Sa ni sa ma ga ri sa ga is stepping down from Madhyama. Ga ri sa sa ni sa ma ga ri sa then ma pa ma ga ma here ma pa plain ma ga ma pa ma ma ri ma ma ga ma then pa sa ni da pa pa is playing and from this panjamam slide that short jump pa sa ni da pa sa ni da pa like in the avarohana ni is being lifted uh, i mean stepping down from short jump sa ni da pa then ma pa ma ga ri we have we are actually familiar with this usage mm, we have actually used this this same usage in this charana itself ma pa ma ga ri sa ni sa ma ga there ga ri sa ma pa ma ga ma pa sa ni da pa ma pa ma ga ri then sa ni sa ga ri ga ma that's the last phrase Sa ni da sa sa da sa ni da sa sa da sa ni sa ga ri. This guy is having a sa ma ga ri ga ri then ga ma ri ma ri ma. Those are the anusurams used in this charana, second charana. So when we combine all those as a phrase, the second charana will sound like. Pa da pa ma ga ma 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 pa ma ga ri ga ga ma pa ma ga ri sa ni sa ma ga ri sa ma pa ma ga ma pa sa ni da pa ma pa ma ga ri sa. So 
that's the end of this tutorial. The Swaram part of Swarajadi Rave Mo in the Ragananda Bhairavi. I hope this was quite an uh, helpful one helpful tutorial for you all so those who have not subscribed my channel do that now itself for more of my videos in my next tutorial i'll be explaining all the uh, i mean the sagitim part so keep on practicing and get thorough with the surams surams part we'll see you all on the uh, in my next video bye